while you're serving the community, you're also trying to also bond and network. And sorry, <laughs> 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 that's your mind. Because that's the purpose. <laughs> that's the real purpose. <laughs> Welcome again <laughs> to our YouTube channel. channel. My name is Josh and Darkest. Um, and we want to thank every one of you for subscribing, mm -hmm. for following, for sharing, yeah, for yeah. liking, mm -hmm. uh, for commenting. Mm -hmm. We are really grateful for all the Continued support. Continued support. Continued support. Yeah. yeah. So we look forward to. You showing yeah. your excitement mm -hmm. with this new episode as well. Share, like, comment. comment. And in fact, if you have topics that you want us to talk about, feel free to drop it even in the comment section. Yes, please. Or you message us on IG. Yes. Yeah, yeah. Welcome, welcome. Welcome. Hey. So Without further ado, we we'll go into the topic of today. Mm -hmm. So recently, I read um, The Garden We Do by Dr. Anita Phillips. Mm -hmm. And she likened um, a number of things to like a garden or like a plant. So she said um, a garden or a plant depends on many things to survive or to grow. And which is also like crucial for like relationship. A relationship that will thrive mm -hmm. will, have, will be dependent on intentional actions. Mm -hmm. by people in that relationship mm -hmm. whether it's a romantic relationship or platonic relationship mm -hmm. for you to try there has to be intentional actions mm -hmm. for it to mm -hmm. try mm -hmm. so today what mm -hmm. a relationship yeah our topic today is on dating <laughs> <laughs> yeah so dating dating, dating. what is yeah dating? so dating I think everybody has an idea of what dating is, right? Mm -hmm. So dating or cutting exactly right, it's important. is <laughs> is <laughs> when know. you're you're having special time with your with your special person. Mm -hmm. um, basically, you're creating time for yourselves. You are building time to communicate, to connect. Mm -hmm. You know, to enjoy the company, the company of yourselves, mm -hmm. to spark romance, to basically get to know yourself better, enjoy yourself. You know, out there, there's a lot of um, responsibilities. responsibilities. You have yeah. to keep up with also, a lot of things. Mm -hmm. But dating is that time you create for yourself, for you to kind of mm -hmm. intentionally Bond, bond, mm -hmm. yeah. yeah, yeah, absolutely. Mm -hmm. And and when people think of dating, mm -hmm. usually the what people think of is oh, I have to take her to the Maldives or take him to the Maldives, yeah. or I have to you know, buy this luxury, luxurious or expensive, expensive things. things. Mm -hmm. But really, you don't have to break the bank mm -hmm, mm -hmm. right and because of that mindset i think that's one of the things that draw people back from bonding to because they are always saying okay when i'm able to afford this then we can do a proper date or when we are able to when we have saved up enough mm -hmm. then that's when or oh, we cannot have that intimacy that we've always created so today you know we are your plug for affordable things yeah things within budgets that you can explore and in fact, you know, that thing about seven seven stuff that Yeah, so I, I was checking something earlier today and mm -hmm. um this um auto. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So this auto uh talked about the seven 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 principle. Yeah. And what that really means for you know those in relationship means um every seven once in seven days, you know have an inexpensive relationship relationship sorry <laughs> 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 sorry sorry guys okay <laughs> sorry. take it back take uh, it back take okay. it back every seven days every seven days have an inexpensive 
dates. <laughs> right? So <laughs> once in seven days, that's like every week. Mm-hmm. I have a date, you right? Inexpensive one. So um not something to elaborate, right? Mm-hmm. Something that is pocket friendly and sometimes something that's even free possibly, right? That you can mm-hmm. do on a weekly basis to bond. So which also like boys to the fact that it's, um, yeah, it's very important. Yeah, I think I've seen something very related, but then they said like once in two weeks, which was which is also mm-hmm. like mm-hmm. very very close, right? So which just to emphasize that it's important to date, and it's not until you break the bank, because I think recently I also saw this um video going viral on ah! social media, just painting picture of you know extravagant things is good those extravagant things are very good if you can afford them but most times most people in relationship try to put off time of enjoying themselves or like enjoying the moment and the little things mm. because or, of those grand ideas of oh, mm. this is the only way we can do it right mm. but in the little or even sometimes it cannot even be it may not even be money right it yeah. can be time right yeah that you don't have at that time but you can still squeeze in some activities just mm. to bond mm. with your partner yeah and uh, yeah that's very powerful i was listening to uh in my small speech okay uh i think this morning or yesterday mm. and he said if you want to change your life mm. change how you spend your time mm. if you apply that to relationship yeah. if you want to change your relationship okay. change how you spend your time Hmm. Like, <laughs> like, spend better quality time together, together if okay. you want to increase the quality of your relationship. Okay, okay. Yeah. yeah, that makes sense. Yeah. So yeah. it's not necessarily the spending; it's also about giving like, time. Not about the money, right? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it yeah. Could be, yeah, it could be the resources. And in fact, everything is even still pointing back to you. If you keep going, deep, connecting, connecting, we'll not go to the main point. <laughs> what I wanted to say is. It keeps pointing back to um sorry love languages mm-hmm, so mm-hmm. some people even though you continue to buy them gifts and all that they might not so much appreciate it as if you spend time with them, with them because mm-hmm. it's quality, quality time right yeah. so yeah so we've gone to different bus stops and and you know on quality time right yeah i th- i think everybody appreciates quality time okay so while some people are okay this is their love language mm-hmm. right they would still cherish but even if it is not your love language i think instinctively humanly speaking mm-hmm. you would appreciate when your partner gives you more time quality time okay so what we're saying in essence is that producer's pov time is also like an essential ingredient of dating yeah. right it Absolutely. doesn't have to only be like spending money. money yeah i think that's the whole point really yeah. like it's just creating time so now the question is are you spending plenty money or little money or no money at all mm. but you are creating that time mm. okay yeah, yeah 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 even if you don't have time we still have something on this list that you can still do together mm. yeah yes, so <laughs> kick it off <laughs> okay um so i mean one very common one yeah popular one yeah easy to do yeah is netflix and chill okay so why are you always saying this netflix and chill because <laughs> <laughs> i remember that in fact the day you last time you said this netflix and chill you even said it there that is it's not expensive like you will save money that day like i say don't spend money Oh, don't spend your money. <laughs> yeah, of course. Netflix like the jokes are part. Yes, Netflix are chill. But mm-hmm. also it could be movies like going to the Yeah, cinemas, yeah, 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 yeah. So, so so that people will not think you're mm-hmm. always Netflix. Mm-hmm. Always mm-hmm. people are Yeah, money. so Oh okay. Going to the cinemas, you can besides Netflix and chill, you can also go to the cinema to have it like a movie date and all the rest, yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. So another thing you can do with your partner right especially for people that you know you like to exercise feet and all that you can do exercises together probably go to gyms together or take walks together 
that's a good way to bond especially for people that probably don't have plenty time right but you're still squeezing time for your daily exercise or how often whatever how often you do it mm -hmm. that's a good way again it could be like a sort of dating or a sort of bonding and intimacy moment with you and your, your spouse yeah absolutely uh, one other thing that you can do mm -hmm. uh, which we plan to do next month yeah. is to volunteer together oh yeah so um basically the two of you can mm -hmm. look out for volunteering opportunities depending and, on your mutual interest exactly yeah. mm -hmm. depending on your mutual interest and while you're serving the community you're also trying to also bond and network and sorry <laughs> 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 that's your mind because <laughs> that's the purpose <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, yeah. You well, actually, it, it gives an opportunity. Yeah, but so, but we're talking about dating. Yeah, yeah. We're yeah but the it. purpose, <laughs> the purpose of the volunteering, yeah, right, is or the one, essence of two of you going together. Together, mm -hmm. the essence of two of you going together is to bond, is to you know create that experience mm. for two of you. Yeah, and only. Then, shared course yeah. shared course yeah and i think it doesn't necessarily have to be like a secular thing as well remember those attitudes we go together to mm -hmm, mm -hmm. both of us will be yeah. sharing time yeah, yeah. so sometimes for christians it could also be like going on evangelisms together and exactly. all that so yeah yeah uh, absolutely okay so another thing again is um games night games night with um like in indoors, it could be indoors, um, probably could have items for games and games nights can, can be anything. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> can be spicy or as harmless as playing <laughs> chess or whatever it is. So yeah, that's a, a way of um, dating, inexpensive dating idea as well. <laughs> Another inexpensive uh, dating ideas for partners would be cooking together mm -hmm. so you can you know check out a recipe that you both don't know how to cook <laughs> just look for something that you can't cook before not your regular meal and then try to follow the directions and see how two of you come up it's just like a joint project and mm -hmm. then you while you're creating something you're actually bonding yeah 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 so also just speaking with Cooking, cooking might not be some people's forte, right? Mm. Or like if they have a small space and all that, and maybe two people can do it together at the same time. One thing again is you could create um like a you can find like a project that you would enjoy. It could be reading. Remember mm -hmm. uh 50 Fridays. Yeah. So on Fridays we read a book. So we read together. So that could be like an activity, just finding a a shared activity you can do together. That's, that's also one of it. If you are feeling deep, deep and philosophical, you can also go to like uh, visit museums mm -hmm. or art galleries together. Yeah, yeah absolutely. Or if you enjoy, maybe you're not philosophical, or if you enjoy appreciate those kind of things, right? Mm -hmm. And they speak to you, so you can go to those places as well to share thoughts on different pieces that you see there. Uh, yeah. Another inexpensive uh, activity you can do as a dating idea mm. is to eat out together. So it doesn't have to be uh, expensive in yeah. a restaurant, but look for a place around you and you know. Yeah, in fact, it could even be like a sort of project in court. Explore. Exploring restaurants. <laughs> I know that's right. what we are starting. <laughs> you just got the list of all the restaurants you yeah, have to go and try them. We saw the cheap ones, the ones where you can have like a yeah a bowl full a bowl of bowl. breakfast and it's mm -hmm. like less than fourteen dollars each. Yeah, less than ten dollars. Yeah. That one that we had like almost two days after. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 So yeah, so that could also be. Like a way of dating or bonding, yeah. uh, which also speaks to the next item, which is like a picnic. So of course, depends on you can choose your area. Yeah, a budget friendly area could be like a park or 
just somewhere where you can sit and lodge like just something like that so the friends on, on your pocket on your on the time you have mm -hmm. we just want to let you know it's all these items you release that impossible is not there right yeah. Yeah. even within your limits of resources or like resources of course mm -hmm. either money or time yeah Dating it doesn't have to be limited or like cutting doesn't have to be limited because oh I don't have enough money or, or time. We hope you are able to find activities within this list. It's also important to to continue to date each other because first it helps to foster continuous communication. Yeah. And also and it also yeah. you know strengthen intimacy yeah and yeah. also like romance as well it keeps the fire yeah <laughs> 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 okay. <laughs> <Smart. laughs> anyway that said though yeah. right i think i think beyond the inexpensive ones uh, yeah. i think you should also plan and budget okay right, of course yeah for grand ones for grand ones right mm -hmm. so the ones for the book and okay before we even leave that i think one other thing that people could do you know is to go down memory lanes for example you've gone for a grand um vacation at some point you can sit down together in a cozy place and just relieve <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you can continue to relieve. Relieve your experience by looking at the pictures you took, the videos of yourself, and just try to recreate that moment again. Yeah, yes, yes, of course. And of course, with that, we are not like saying those grand ones are not good. For example, if somebody wants to sponsor us some these, or Zanzibar, mm. or Tikan. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. So it doesn't mean we we are saying those ones are not good, but like for example, within uh, yeah, time, if you look at the frequency or the resources you have mm. at at hand as well, and also the frequency, yeah. So you shouldn't suspend. You shouldn't suspend the moment yeah. till you can afford all those big ones. Yeah. So we hope with this few points we've been able to convince you and not convince you that dating can, can be. Inexpensive. Correct. <laughs> <laughs> Before you leave, don't forget to like, subscribe, yeah. comment, share, and hit the notification <laughs> button. Yeah. <laughs> bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Thanks, guys.